I like to say hello and welcome you. Good day, that is my name. What's going on, guys? My name's Jimmy, also known as the Unknown Mustang. And if you're an old subscriber, you're just got in your sub box and you're like, holy fuck, an Unknown Mustang video. And if you're new, I'll, I hope you stay around because this is going to be a fun channel. I guarantee it. Because I'm going to be doing everything that I find entertaining here. Old subscribers will know that, hey, I play Call of Duty. Well, get get rid of that fact, because Call of Duty sucks. I absolutely hate Call of Duty. What you're looking at here is what I play 99.9% .9 of the time, along with a couple other games. What you see, what I just did right there was kind of a Coast Guard pickup, because of my friend Brett, he was in the water, and then he goes, shoots down this thing. This is kind of stuff we do. I play Battlefield 3 a lot, and I play a lot of it to have fun and do stuff like you're about to see now, which, is, just let this clip play out, you'll see. I would also play a lot of Battlefield to, you know, have fun and win. Winning's a big thing with Battlefield. It's not like Call of Duty. Call of Duty, if you know, is all, every, every kid on there is like, oh, I got this kind of KD, la 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 la. Well, you know what? KD fucking sucks. It's all about winning, right? Well, Battlefield, if you play Battlefield a lot, you know. This game's about winning. Uh, speaking of the fun stuff that we do, because me and my friends derp around a lot. It's, it is crazy amount of how much we just do stupid shit all the time. What we're trying to do here is called a heli bomb. I kind of coined it a heli bomb. I don't know if that's new or not. That's been made up. I don't know. We call it a heli bomb. What my friend Brett's doing down here, and he just threw a grenade, is he's trying to put C4 on the bottom of the helicopter. So then we would go hover above some other helicopter or not helicopter but like a tank or something like that as we're going to do now and then he blows c4 blows up the tank and we fly away didn't really work out and you know what that works out that's how it works out a lot with a lot of the time it just, shit just blows up but the other game i play 99 percent of the time is gran turismo 5 gran turismo 5 is also i mean it's a really fun game i love cars Absolutely in love with cars. That's what I want to do with my life, basically. Drive cars, race them, fix them, whatever you want to do with them. Right now, I'm playing with my friend Don Matty. He used to upload videos, and I don't know what happened to that, but he's a really good friend of mine. He does a lot of Gran Turismo stuff. Right now, I'm racing with him and a bunch of other friends, and I'm about to pass that guy. I don't know if that was an illegal pass or not, but I don't care. I won the race. We're racing GT40s here. Uh, there's a lot of stuff I know about cars that I'm, I may be able to share to you. I like testing cars, seeing what they can do, doing stuff with that on the game and in real life. Uh, a lot of races like this. A lot of races where it's car-only races. A lot of races where it's, I think my car's faster than yours, so I'm going to beat it. And not beat it in the sense that, we have the exact same car in this kind of situation. Like my friend Jake, who has a Peugeot, some kind of race car, Lamaze setup, bullcrap. Don't know exactly what what name it is, but one day I was like, "Hey, I bet my Subaru could beat your your Peugeot," and he was like, "What?" It was 2005 Subaru WRX, and I, you know what? I beat him purely because I could drive. I think a little better than him. Yeah, he's getting better, but I mean, point is, is I beat him with a worse car. Or other times, me and a couple friends will have Fiat 500s, race GTRs, and we'll win on the Nurburgring. It's a crazy thing. But a lot of, another thing I like, love to do on this game is race on Na NASCAR tracks. There's only two. It's Indy, the Indianapolis uh, Motor Speedway and Daytona International Speedway. Might have that name wrong. Don't hate me for it. But anyway... I love race, racing NASCAR races, and it looks might look boring to you right now because, well, no, there's not a lot going on except for stupid Juan Pablo Montoya over there spinning out looking for a jet dryer. But we're all racing around, and when you're in it, racing it, it's a lot more entertaining because there's bumping, there's bashing, everyone's yelling at each other if they got mics on because someone cut off someone else. But you have me here just bump drafting somebody else so we could get away from the craziness. This was probably lap two. Or lap one. But I was probably lap two starting right now. And everybody else, everybody's already racing in a 10 lap race. Which is already kind of long. Everyone's racing like it's the last lap. And that gets dangerous really quick. See look at that. I don't know if you saw that right there. Four wide. Four wide is dangerous on that track. And shit gets crazy immediately. So I mean. It's a lot of fun to watch I think. So I'm going to be posting it. That's what I'm doing now. I'm posting whatever the fuck I want. Whenever the fuck I want. Because it entertains me. 
So after this clip, you're going to see a Batman game. Batman Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, those are the shit. I believe that is the best single, well not the best single player, but the best superhero game ever made on the face of the fucking planet. And as you can see here, I was winning, I haven't ended up winning that race. Here we go. Batman Arkham City, and this is the Joker's Carnival map that you got for pre-ordering at GameStop. I'm going to go on a little tear here, because, well, Batman's fucking Batman, and Batman is awesome. So, I mean, it's not really too unexpected, I would think. But yeah, I play this game all the time. I just downloaded the DLC for it, Harley Quinn's Revenge. Just beat it as I'm doing this. It's fucking great. So I might do a little Let's Play on this if you haven't, guys haven't seen it. I don't know. I'll probably do it anyway just for shits and giggles. But I love this game and I'll play both of them again and again and again. It's been, I think, three years since Arkham Asylum came out. And I think it's been eight months since Arkham City's come out. But I've beat this game like three times. A 100% beat. That's... I think that's pretty much of a, of, a, of a beat right there. But my name's Jimmy, also known as the Unknown Mustang. I hope you guys stick around for the whenever this channel decides to stop again. I start stop posting. Because there's going to be a lot of fun stuff that come up. And it's going to be really entertaining, I think. So I really, really, really hope this goes well. I hope some people see this. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Alright, I'll see ya.